Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. You have spent any time tending to gardens, you know that enjoying your outdoor space often comes with a common annoyance, mosquitoes. In our discussion today, we're going to uncover some natural, plant-based solutions to this issue. There are several plants known for their mosquito repelling qualities, and incorporating them into your garden can make your time outdoors more pleasant without relying heavily on chemical repellents. We'll explore these plants, how they work, and how you can effectively use them in your garden. Whether you have a sprawling backyard or a cozy patio, these plants can help you reclaim your space from these pesky intruders. Let's dive in and discover these nature-friendly solutions together. In our pursuit to create a mosquito-free garden, it's important to first understand why certain plants are effective at repelling these pests. The secret lies in the natural compounds found within the plants, which mosquitoes find unattractive or even repulsive. Over the years, through both experience and research, gardeners and scientists alike have identified several plants with these properties. Let's start with one of the most commonly known mosquito repelling plants, citronella. Often used in mosquito repellent candles and oils, the citronella plant emits a strong aroma that is unappealing to mosquitoes. This plant is a type of grass that grows quite easily in full sun and well-drained soil. Having a few of these in your garden can help keep the mosquito population at bay. Another notable mention is lavender. Known for its soothing fragrance and beautiful blooms, lavender is also a natural mosquito repellent. The oils and fragrance released from lavender are undesirable to mosquitoes. Lavender thrives in sunny, dry climates, and once established, it's quite drought resistant, making it an excellent choice for various garden settings. The next plant on our list is marigolds. These bright, beautiful flowers contain pyrethrum, a compound used in many insect repellents. Marigolds are easy to grow and can be an effective way to keep mosquitoes away, especially when planted near entryways and windows. Basil is not only a wonderful herb for cooking, but also doubles as a mosquito repellent. This herb emits a scent that mosquitoes don't like, and it's especially effective when the leaves are crushed and the oils are released. Basil prefers warm weather and needs to be watered regularly. Another herb, lemongrass, contains citronella, much like the citronella plant, making it effective against mosquitoes. It's a tropical plant that prefers full sun and well-drained soil. Plus, it adds a lovely lemony scent to your garden or patio. These plants work by masking the scents that attract mosquitoes, essentially hiding the cues mosquitoes use to find their targets. While no plant is 100% effective in repelling mosquitoes, incorporating these into your garden can significantly reduce the presence of mosquitoes. Incorporating these plants into your garden or outdoor space is a natural and aesthetically pleasing way to combat mosquitoes. In the next sections, we will delve deeper into how to grow these plants and maximize their mosquito repelling capabilities. As someone who has spent decades in the garden, I can attest to the difference these plants can make in creating a more enjoyable, mosquito-free outdoor environment. Now that we've identified some plants known for their mosquito repelling properties, let's discuss how to integrate them effectively into your garden. The key is not just to grow these plants, but to position and care for them in a way that maximizes their repellent effect. Firstly, consider the layout of your garden or outdoor space. Since the goal is to keep mosquitoes at bay, strategically place these plants in areas where you spend most of your time outdoors. For instance, planting citronella or lemongrass near seating areas, patios, or decks can be particularly effective. Similarly, placing pots of marigolds or basil near doorways, windows, or along walkways can help deter mosquitoes from entering your home or lingering in frequently used pathways. Container gardening is a splendid way to use these plants if you have limited space, or if some areas of your garden aren't suitable for planting. Containers allow you to move the plants to different locations based on your needs, such as bringing them closer to your seating area when you're outside or placing them strategically during outdoor events. Ensure that the containers have adequate drainage and are filled with a suitable potting mix to promote healthy growth. Proper care is essential to ensure these plants grow robustly and produce the oils that repel mosquitoes. Most of these plants, like lavender and basil, prefer full sun, so make sure they're positioned where they'll receive plenty of daylight. Watering needs vary among these plants. For example, lavender prefers drier conditions, while basil needs consistent moisture. Research the specific needs of each plant and provide the right care. A healthy, vigorously growing plant will be more effective at repelling mosquitoes. Additionally, some of these plants, such as basil, 
can be used more effectively by crushing a few leaves to release the essential oils. You can rub these leaves on your skin for a mild repellent effect, but be sure to test a small area first for any allergic reactions. However, remember that this is a temporary solution and should not replace standard mosquito repellents. Incorporating mosquito repelling plants into your landscape design can also enhance the overall aesthetics of your garden. These plants not only serve a functional purpose, but also add beauty and fragrance. For instance, the lush foliage of lemongrass or the vibrant flowers of marigolds can contribute to the visual appeal of your outdoor space. By strategically placing these plants and providing them with appropriate care, you can create a more enjoyable outdoor environment that naturally discourages mosquitoes. In the next section, we'll delve into additional tips and considerations for making the most of these mosquito repelling plants. In addition to planting and positioning mosquito repelling plants, there are several supplementary measures you can take to enhance their effectiveness. Combining these approaches can create a more comprehensive strategy for keeping mosquitoes at bay in your garden. First and foremost, it's crucial to eliminate standing water in your garden, as it's a prime breeding ground for mosquitoes. Check for and regularly empty any containers, pots, or garden features that may collect rainwater. Keeping your garden free from standing water reduces the mosquito population and, consequently, the need for repellents. Another effective method is companion planting. Some plants, when grown together, can enhance each other's growth or pest repelling properties. For example, planting marigolds near your vegetable garden can not only help repel mosquitoes, but also other pests that might be harmful to your vegetables. Experiment with different combinations to find what works best in your garden's ecosystem. Besides planting, consider the use of essential oils derived from these mosquito repelling plants. Essential oils like citronella, lavender, and lemongrass can be used in diffusers or diluted and applied to the skin as natural repellents. This method can be particularly useful for personal protection when spending time in the garden. However, always perform a patch test to ensure there's no allergic reaction and be mindful of the concentration of the oils. Creating a breeze can also help deter mosquitoes. If you have an outdoor seating area, consider using a fan. The air movement makes it harder for mosquitoes to fly and also helps dissipate body scents that attract them. This simple strategy can significantly enhance your comfort during outdoor activities. Regular garden maintenance can also play a role in reducing mosquito habitats. Keep your garden well trimmed and free from overgrowth where mosquitoes may find shelter. This includes regularly mowing the lawn and pruning bushes and hedges. A tidy garden is not only aesthetically pleasing, but also less inviting to mosquitoes. Finally, while the focus is on natural methods, don't overlook the importance of personal protection. When spending extended periods in the garden, especially during dusk or dawn when mosquitoes are most active, wearing appropriate clothing, such as long sleeves and pants, can provide an additional layer of defense. Combining these supplementary measures with the use of mosquito repelling plants creates a multifaceted approach to managing mosquitoes in your garden. This holistic strategy not only helps in reducing the reliance on chemical repellents, but also contributes to a healthier, more natural garden environment. Remember, the key to success is consistency and combining various methods to suit your specific garden conditions and lifestyle. While we focused on natural plant-based solutions to repel mosquitoes, it's important to have a realistic perspective on their effectiveness and to understand their limitations. Planting mosquito repelling plants is an excellent step towards a more pleasant outdoor environment, but it's not a foolproof solution. These plants can help reduce the presence of mosquitoes, but they may not eliminate them completely. It's crucial to recognize that the mere presence of these plants in the garden isn't enough to repel mosquitoes. The plants emit the repellent compounds when their leaves are crushed or when they're under stress, such as being brushed against. Simply having the plants in your garden might not create a strong enough barrier to mosquitoes. For a more direct effect, you may need to interact with the plants, like crushing the leaves to release the oils or using the plant extracts in diffusers. In addition to the physical limitations, environmental factors also play a significant role. Windy conditions, for example, can disperse the scent of the repellent plants, reducing their effectiveness. Similarly, a large garden or outdoor space might require a significant number of repellent plants to make a noticeable difference. Moreover, each mosquito species reacts differently to various repellents, whether natural or synthetic. What might be effective against one species may not necessarily deter another. Therefore, managing expectations when using plants as mosquito repellents is essential. Given these limitations, 
It's advisable to use mosquito repelling plants as part of a broader integrated pest management strategy. This approach can include maintaining proper garden hygiene, eliminating standing water, using physical barriers like nets, and applying personal repellents when necessary. It's about creating multiple layers of defense rather than relying on a single solution. It's also worth considering the use of other beneficial plants and garden features that attract mosquito predators. For instance, plants that attract birds, bats, or dragonflies can contribute to natural mosquito control, as these animals feed on mosquitoes. Staying informed about mosquito-borne diseases prevalent in your area and taking appropriate precautions is vital. While natural methods can reduce the number of mosquitoes, they may not offer sufficient protection in areas with a high risk of diseases like malaria or dengue fever. In conclusion, managing mosquitoes in the garden is a multifaceted task that can be approached effectively with a combination of natural and practical methods. Utilizing plants known for their mosquito repelling properties is a great start. These plants can provide a degree of protection and contribute to a more enjoyable outdoor experience. However, it's important to view them as part of a broader strategy rather than a standalone solution. Combining the use of these plants with other measures, such as eliminating standing water, practicing good garden hygiene, and considering physical barriers, creates a more robust defense against mosquitoes. Remember, the effectiveness of repellent plants is enhanced when they are actively used, like crushing the leaves to release their essential oils, or incorporating their extracts in various forms around your garden and outdoor living spaces. Additionally, being aware of the environmental impact of your choices is crucial. Encouraging biodiversity by planting a variety of species that attract natural predators of mosquitoes adds another layer to your garden's ecosystem and helps maintain a natural balance. For those times when you need extra protection, especially during peak mosquito activity times like dusk and dawn, don't hesitate to use personal repellents or protective clothing. In areas with a high prevalence of mosquito-borne diseases, these additional precautions are essential. Gardening is not just about creating a beautiful space, it's about crafting an environment that you can enjoy and feel comfortable in. While no method is 100% effective in repelling mosquitoes, a thoughtful and integrated approach can significantly reduce their presence and enhance your time spent outdoors.